YouTube, what is up, Dini Gaming here. Another stiller commentary coming your way tonight. Um, this one, I have a few thoughts on a few things that I heard today uh, through Twitter and other things like that. But I just want to start off with, I will be cooking tuna again. I'm still stuck at 58 cooking, I believe that was mine in the other video. We're doing this in the general store and I'm gaining about 2.6, 2.7k XP per inventory. Alright guys, today our topic for our skiller commentary is the news story regarding Monte Teo, uh, the Notre Dame linebacker, um, who supposedly faked like, I need to get the story straight, I really haven't looked into it, but this is what I've heard from Twitter and such, he made a story about his girlfriend dying and supposedly she is not even real, you know, uh, if this is true, First off, I didn't have huge respect for Teo. You know, I've heard about his stories. I've heard about how epic he is. And, yeah, he's a great football player. But throughout the Heisman voting, I was voting for Johnny Football pretty much the entire way through. And, you know, I really wasn't a huge fan of Teo throughout his college career. And he came up very small in the, champ in the national championship game. So, I don't know. I, I just never really liked him that much. And... Hearing this story, first off, the fact that you would make a story about someone dying is crazy enough. But the fact that you're lying about it is, that is sad. And it, it really, it kills his character if this story is true. Now I'm, not, now, I'm not sure if this is actually confirmed or not. But if it is, all my respect that I had for Teo as a football player and as a person is officially gone. I will never respect someone who makes a story about someone. I... You cannot joke about someone dying. That's just a topic that I feel it's just disrespectful to do. And dying is a thing that, you know, it happens to everyone at some point, you know. But it's not something you joke about and screw around about, you know, daily. I, I just think that's very outrageous. And especially since he is such a big figure in the college football land. The fact that he'd make that for maybe extra sympathy or... To make him sound like he's overcome such big things. I think it's outrageous. And I think it's brutal to be honest with you guys. Just wanted to give you my thoughts on that whole story. And you know maybe I'll comment on it later if I find out it's 100% true. But uh, yeah I am a big sports fan. So a lot of these commentaries may involve sports. I know some of you guys will love that. Some of you guys may not like that that much. But I just wanted to let you know that some of these occasionally will be about sports, big sports topics that are happening around the world. Alright guys, thank you once again, and I know I couldn't get a stream in tonight, but we're looking to stream uh, either tomorrow night late or a lot Friday, so I know we still haven't hit that 1k view, we're at like 993, but we will get there, and um, we will get there easily. Alright, thanks guys, and until next time, YouTube.